Seki to Imo states, the All Progressives Congress nation, a national working committee, has dismissed and says the expulsion of the party's governorship candidate, Senator Hope Uzodimma, by a faction of the APC led by Mr. Nwofo and loyal to Governor Roger Sokrocha, is null and void. In a statement by the party's national publicity secretary, Mr. Isa Anulu, the APC says, Imo State Working Committee of the APC led by Mr. Nwafo was dissolved after a majority of members of the party in the state lost confidence in their ability to lead the party to victory in the forthcoming general elections, especially due to their involvement in several anti-party activities. The party went further to say that it has since set up a caretaker committee in Imo State led by Chief Marcelinus Lemibu to pilot the affairs of the party in Imo State. Therefore, Mr. Ilamigwo remains the only recognized Imo State chairman, and any decision which do not emanate from this recognized caretaker committee as regards the affairs of APC in Imo State is null and void. Well, let's get some updates on the political situation there. Um, let's bring you our correspondent, Eitope Kutui. He fills us in on the latest. Also, we should remember that Imo State has the highest number of governorship candidates in the country, 71 jostling for the governorship seats in the state. Um, one of, some of the frontliners include a uh, right honorable Emeka Eadia, the former deputy speaker of the Federal House of Representatives. We also have um, Senator um, uh, Ifai Ararume, who is the candidate of the All Progressive Grand Alliance. We also have the former governor of Imo State, Ikedi Akim, contesting under the Accord Party. And a few moments from now, we'll also be witnessing a mega rally of the candidate of the Action Alliance, Honorable Uche Uwonsu, who is also a frontliner in this election. I tell you, Imo is a state to watch in the couple of days, especially in the March 2nd governorship elections. While promising credible, free and fair election, INEC in the state has also been sensitizing Imolites on the need to collect their PVCs. The security operatives are also promising that they will remain unbiased in this forthcoming elections in the states. From Oweridi, Mosley Capital, Eito Channel Television News.